Hi, Stephanie Lee Medium here, doing my monthly book review. And for December, I've chosen a book which I feel like represents the month. It's called Attitudes of Gratitude. Um, we're, as we're kind of winding down 2020 and everybody's getting ready for 2021 because they want 2020 to be over, I just wanted us to learn a little bit more about gratitude since it's kind of the seasonal, that time of year to talk about gratitude um, and kind of delve deeper into that. So in this month's book reviews, um, I'm going to be talking about the gifts of gratitude, the attitudes of gratitude, and the practices of gratitude. So right now we're gonna jump into gifts of gratitude. So the author starts out the book by saying that she kind of lived a life of um, negativity. When was the next shoe gonna drop and something bad gonna happen? She always saw the dark in everything. Um, and she just couldn't get out of that mindset. She just, it, it, it was just kind of like who she was, right? Um, and then basically what happened is things sort of started to change for her. She really wanted to work on herself and she um, she said it wasn't like one particular um, event or timeline, but as she started to heal, she started to be more grateful and it kind of led her on this path. So she adopted people around her um, who were very, very grateful in their, and they were very genuine in their gratefulness. And it kind of helped her, it pulled her along to then really search for more and more gratitude in her life. And basically, um, it basically helped her write the book. She's saying that gratitude is not just the key, it is the magic key. It's the magic key that is just the most simplistic thing that you can do to like change your perspective and change your life basically. If you can just adopt being grateful every single day um, for things that are around you, you will start to see more and more gratitude in the world because you're attracting that. You are attracting more gratitude toward you. It's total law of attraction. You see gratitude, you attract gratitude, you see gratitude, you attract gratitude. It's a wonderful, wonderful perspective for your life. And I encourage you to try it. Just even like one day, just try being more grateful for all the things you see. If you take a walk, maybe there's a tree that has started changing season and now it's full of red and beautiful gold leaves and how beautiful that is and how what a great day it is. It may be not raining, but it's not sunny, but it's a grateful day because you're out, you're able to take a walk, you're able to get some exercise. And that just leads to more and more and more gratitude. So in conclusion, gratitude will definitely change your perspective and it will change your life. And I just encourage you to do that. Um, for me, what I do every night before I go to bed is I think about five to 10 things that I'm grateful for. And they may just be like the very most simple, simple things. Hot shower. Um, I was able to get laundry done. I was able to make dinner and I cleaned up after dinner. Um, I was able to read a couple of chapters in a book or I watched my favorite t TV show. I'm glad that that was on or I spent time with my children and I saw how exciting it was that they were learning new things and to watch their minds grow and learn. It's just taking that time every single day to notice what's really going on in your life and being so grateful for it. So I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, tune in next week for more in-depth um, ideas on gratitude. And um, if you're interested in having a reading with me, please go to my website, Stephanie Lee Medium. But until then, I'll see you next week. Thanks.